Hello guys, today I will be talking about the important question that asked from the embryology section of anatomy during the semesters and the first of examination of the first year MBBS. So, first we will talk about the questions of general embryology. Uh, in case of general embryology, the enumerated questions come on the phases of fertilization, events of fertilization, results of fertilization is very important, ectopic site of implantation is also very important, and uh, question can also come on the derivatives of uh, neural crest paraxial mesoderm, endoderm, mesoderm, ectoderm, and the placental barriers, and the content of the umbilical cord. The placental barriers is very important. Uh, question can come on uh, development of uh, comp developmental components of the inferior vena cava in case of systemic embryology, derivatives of uh, foregut, dorsal mesogastrium, medgut, hindgut is very important. And uh, question can also come on the derivatives of uh, paramesonectric duct, mesonectric duct, primitive urogenital mass, and the cloaca. Uh, this is very, very important, the derivatives of the pharyngeal arches, and it is surely going to be asked during the exam. Uh, derivatives of first, second, third, fourth pharyngeal arch and the pharyngeal pouches is generally asked. In case of general embryology, the short note uh, can come on the capacitation, spermatogenesis, oogenesis, fertilization, but gastrulation is important. Division of decidua, notochord and its formation is important. Neurilation, neural crest cell, mesodermal somites, neural tube defects is important. Question can also come on development of thoraco-abdominal diaphragm. This is very, very important. Devel defects in diaphragm development, development of body cavities, placental barriers is again very important placenta previa, umbilical cord. Now moving on to the cardiovascular system in case of systemic embryology. The question can come on the development of the interatrial septum. This is very important. Development of uh, interventricular septum is also important. Malformations of heart. This is the usually asked question during the semesters as well as in the prof examination. So you must uh, by heart this, the answer to this question, malformations of heart. Double aortic arch is also asked, palate's tetralogy, ventricular septal defect can also be asked. Uh, circulatory changes at birth is very important, aortic arches and its derivative is less important. Developmental components of the inferior vena cava is also less important. Fetal circulation is very important. Transposition of great vessels can be asked. Now moving on to the respiratory and the digestive system. The question comes on tracheoesophageal fistula. This is very important. Maturation of lung is not that important. Rotation of gut is also important. Gastrochesis, omphalocele, these are lesser important questions. And neuler pancreas and the development of pancreas, these, are, these two questions are very important. Coming on to the CNS and the urogenital system, the question can be asked on development of suprarenal gland, not at all important question. Polycystic kidney disease is also not important. Horse kidney is also not important. Ectopic testis is very important. Hypoespedias, descent of testes. Cryptorchidin is important. In case of head and neck, the question can come on uh, brinkle cyst, cervical sinus. Development of tongue is important. Development of thyroid gland is not that important. Development of face is very, 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 very important. Cleft lip and cleft palate is again very important. Thank you.